Mariah, welcome to Connecticut, first of all. So, so what was it that pushed you over the edge that you wanted to come to Connecticut from Texas? Honestly, it's one of those things where you just know. It's You go to every school, you visit, and you like everyone, and you don't know what to do. But when you go to the school that you're supposed to be at, you know. So I can't just tell you exactly, but it was just a feeling that I was like, I have to be at this school. It was because you heard we had better barbecue up here, wasn't it? <laughs> yes, the barbecue is pretty good. I actually had some. They have it around campus, too. If not that, then it had to be because we have better football teams than <laughs> at UConn, <laughs> than Texas. <laughs> So, so after a few days, you're a little banged up right now. Uh, co the coaches so far and what you've seen, uh, are, are these still the same charming people that were in your living room? Or? I mean, you know it's going to change. I mean, it's, it's basketball. Everything is serious, but it's everything I expected. You know, I didn't want anybody to come and try to be nice to me, be soft with me. I want to be pushed to my limits so that I can be a better basketball player. I was asking Morgan, can we can we give you guys like a nickname or something so that you're not just the three heralded freshmen every time you or the three you get mentioned? I don't really know. Yeah, the three name. amigos or something. Let's come up with something Anything for you guys. Like that is fine. We actually were talking about that one time. I think we were saying the three musketeers or something, but we were just joking around. I'm sure it'll come eventually. Well, now, so you've got a number of quality guards to play alongside and stuff. What are they teaching you and what are you learning from somebody like Bria? You've played international ball and stuff, so has she. How, how does she share and teach some of the things that she's learned so far? I think she just watches what I do what I do on the court and then she comes to me and she's like, hey, instead of doing this, do that. Or instead of going this way, go that way. They just show you little tips and things that you can do so that you know when you're on the court that you won't get yelled at from the coaches for doing the wrong things. And uh, now you were, you were homeschooled, right? So one thing I always wondered was when, what do you, where do you go when you get detention? <laughs> Never got detention, <laughs> ever. So um, I mean, I guess I went to my room. And, yeah, you didn't have to take the trash out or something like that for a punishment. No, I, mean, I never, I never really got in trouble being at home. Well, Mariah, welcome to Connecticut. Thank I'm looking forward to seeing you play in games, and I know the state is looking forward to seeing you. Thank you.